Good afternoon, Vikes. This week is Anti-Bullying Week, and we also caught up with Mr. Collins about Sleep in a Box. I'm Cameron. I'm Sydney, and your news starts now. This week is Anti-Bullying Week, and did you know nationally 70.6% of young people say they have seen bullying in their schools? See it, stop it. Picture retakes are October 4th during seminar. Sign up in C2. Friday is the last day you can submit your school store logo and design to Mr. Tinsley through Schoology. FCA is selling shirts until Friday. Forms are found in the Schoology group. Turn money in to Ms. Eisenbarth in E10. The next district wellness night is October 11th on the high school track from 6 to 8. We caught up with Mr. Collins about what went on at Sleep in a Box. I'm here with Mr. Collins. Can you tell us more about what went on at Sleep in a Box? Sure. It was a fantastic year, and we've continued the legacy and the tradition of raising money for th three local homeless support organizations, the Rescue Mission, uh, PANT, which takes care of animals that belong to homeless people, and the North Topeka Outreach. We've raised over $900, uh, so we'll be able to divide that three ways. And we've also, uh, were able to collect uh, a trailer load of canned goods to be able to provide those organizations. And I really want to thank uh, the, my, my co-sponsor, Mrs. Miller, and our officers. Uh, Veronica Fales, our president, did a really good job. It was a, a wonderful laugh uh, uh, with her emceeing the, 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 all the fun games that we had. Uh, and then her planning, as well as the planning of uh, Zyan and Maddie and Sarah and Summer and Zane, uh, uh, it just all came together so nicely. And can you tell us more about the activities that went on at Sleep in a Box? Sure. Well, there's the traditional games that we've had uh, year after year, Laird Man and Running Man. And this year we extended Running Man. So individuals were running, some of them with over 150 items of clothing on them once around the track. Uh, and then uh, we did Dumpster Dive again. And uh, this is only my second year, but it was by far the best year. And uh, the way that the officers organized that with the uh, the, the different boxes uh, it just made it a lot of fun and then we added a couple of new games uh, the eggs uh, the egg race uh, was a, a hoot and everybody enjoyed that okay anything else you'd like to add uh, I really think that uh, it's fantastic that uh, that Interact and Seaman High School have a program like this because uh, the homeless problem in uh, Topeka and in Shawnee County is something that is tremendous. And uh, for all the participants, thanks, and we'll see you next year. Thank you. All the cans of money donated will be going to a good cause. Jocelyn's will be giving away five free cameras. If you order your yearbook online, you are automatically entered to win a Canon digital camera. Contest ends October 13th. ACT sessions are now available. Each session is $10. Pay the bank and turn your receipt into Mr. Kuhn, Ms. Majette, or Ms. Marshbank. The Viking Brew Coffee Shop is open Monday, Wednesday, Friday mornings in the Commons Concession Stand. Now after the break, we'll go over to sports. When riding the bus, make sure to do the following. Stay seated and follow rules and procedures. <laughs> Always report bullying. Pick up trash. Use indoor voices. Respect your peers. Have a nice day. You have a great day. Be a Viking. Respect the bus. Seaman strong.
There's a volleyball game tonight. They're facing off against Junction City and T High at home. Sharp students will get in for free to the volleyball game with their student ID. Please see the Schoology page for more details. And that's all for the sports today. Now over to Cameron with the weather. It is currently 75 and tonight will be 60. Your 3-day forecast consists of highs in the 70s, lows in the 60s. Today in history is Mean Girls Appreciation Day and Gwen Stefani's birthday. Now back over to your anchors. That's all we have for today, Vikes. Everyone has a story. Don't bully and seek to understand.